This particular residency program was specifically directed towards Western Carolina University students. Paul definitely met the qualifications. We had an interview with him. He was a very engaging and nice guy, which was very important. He's going to be interacting with the public and sort of managing our studio. Paul was given a schedule and what he did with his time was up to him and he seemed like the kind of guy that was going to use his time wisely and he did and he created quite a bit of work while he was here with us. Taking my craft to the next level, you know, that's, that's, that's the incentive. It's a really great, great opportunity. My main function here at the Bascom is to be working, to be painting in my studio, to have an open door. The public can come in, ask me questions. That's been a fun aspect of, of being here. The resident program here is a reciprocal relationship. They're the representative of the institution in our studio. So we offer an opportunity for an emerging artist to explore their studio practice further. And at the same time, they provide an ambassador to the community. They can act as an instructor for youth and adults. They can speak about their work to the community at large that are moving through the building. We're providing a space and housing and, and this incredible opportunity where they can solely focus on their work. This is the first time in my life where I have been able to just work on my painting and it's been amazing. I've always had classes going on. I've always had a job um, that's not involved in art and it's hard to dedicate as much time to painting as I would like to. So this is the first time I've ever been able to just get in there and just grind out work in a studio. And I surprised myself at how much I was able to produce. He had time to focus and concentrate on his work and explore. And he did that and was very successful and created this very interesting body of work that even in four weeks,